There's going to be one main difference between the frog blood and human blood. And tell me what's the difference, my friends. You should be able to Only see it. Exactly. Ours didn't have. Do you remember why ours didn't have? They carried oxygen. Yes. So these carry oxygen as well, but these are a lot less efficient. Like when you look at the evolution of the animals, mammals optimized for efficiency. And one of the things how they did it is that they can uh, carry a lot more oxygen in our blood than other animals. So amphibians, um, reptiles, fish will have so-called nucleated blood cells. And nucleus are the dots that you immediately recognize. And ours don't have. They have this like donut shape. They got rid of the nucleus because in the process of evolving, it turned out that it's more efficient to not have a nucleus for a red, a red blood cell who has the only task of carrying oxygen. So these are human. And another difference. What's the other difference other than the uh, nucleus inside? This is a circle. And the b a frog was what? O also like optimization because when you have something when you have a red blood cell that is oval in comparison to a round one the round one has a lot more surface well not a lot more but has more surface compared to the oval one of the same size that means it can carry more oxygen so our guys well yeah it, it's it's not a ball it's it's a circle but the same principle applies. So this is frog, guys.